And good evening, everybody. We're watching live in Alaska across the state, Fairbanks, Anchorage, Juneau, into the Ava Glavin Sports Complex on the campus of Ferris State University in Big Rapids, Michigan. The Bulldogs come into the contest ranked 18th in the nation this year, 1-1-2 on the season. However, the opposition, or else the Alaska Nanooks, 2-1-1 for my partner, Dan Kowalski, and myself, Dominic Kennick, a special hello to those watching on Fox 7 in Fairbanks, Alaska, and GCI Cable 1 throughout the rest of the state. Dan, it's the start to the end of the Central Collegiate Hockey Association, a perfect conference. The CCHA will come to a close at the end of this regular season, but hey, we still have a long, a lot of hockey left. Absolutely. Welcome in Alaska for game one of a long CCHA season. Keep in mind, Alaska coming off back-to-back -back wins over Merrimack and number two, North Dakota, last weekend. They're coming in playing some good hockey. Don't don't forget that Alaska two seasons ago was the team that knocked out Ferris State in the NCAA tournament. The Bulldogs were one game out of the NCAA tournament, and that team was the Alaska Nanooks to take Ferris State's spot. So kind of a little bad blood here, but I know a lot of good friends from both teams on each other on the ice. Absolutely. Both teams well coached as well. Head coach Dallas Ferguson of Fairbanks, head coach Bob Daniels of Fair State. The thing that I like about Dallas Ferguson, the Alaska Fairbanks coach, he has spent a lot of time in Alaska. He's played for the Anchorage Aces. He's played for the Fairbanks Ice Dogs, uh, coached the Fairbanks Ice Dogs, and now he coached here for the Alaska Nanook. So a lot of time for Alaska from Dallas from head coach for Alaska, Dallas Ferguson. Yeah, absolutely. He's a great recruiter as well. He gets a lot of those Alaska kids, a lot of kids to come out to Alaska, and he's got his team playing some good, good hockey. They want to celebrate the legacy walking away with the CCHA crown. And we'll be back. Uh, you're listening to, you're watching Ferris State Hockey on Fox 7 and GCI Cable 1. Right circle, bottom of the circle now. He'll skate behind the net, far corner. Campbell to the point, off the back shot, the last goal gets strike first. It's number 13, the defenseman, Kari Odegaard off the bench. Go back to Kunick. Kunick tries near side. Quinn, backdoor play, back they score on the power play with five seconds left. That was pretty as Beck puts Alaska up two to nothing. He had a Di Martino on the hit far corner, trying to get to Kane too far behind him. Schmidt, now the shot, he scores! Connor Schmidt from the right wing point puts the Bulldogs on the board. 2-1 with 2.02 to go in the first. And up forward. Binkley, shot, hits traffic in front. It's a good block shot from Tyler Mor Morley. Now Binkley fires, he scores! Binkley from the left point ties it up with 1.07 to go. Two goals in less than 60 seconds. I'll seconds tell you left in the first period. Shot left point. Say may they bat it out of the air and Alaska comebacks and takes the lead. 3-2 is a shot from the left wing point. I believe from Justin Tateson off the back wall, bounced in front and batted out of the air. A last three o'clock start in Alaskan time, but I believe this is tape delayed on Fox 7 and GCI Cable 1. Simone Denis from the right point ties it up. Top right corner pass Thompson off the draw. Off on it, but Bulldogs recover. Binkley again. Far left corner, across the line, bonus shot, he scores! Ferris State takes the lead, his second of the game. What a pass by Travis White, the spot bonus, back door. I think bonus is even shocked that got to him. Yeah, let's get up the right wing, send it near side for Younghorn. It's a good step there by Connor Schmidt. Bulldogs have numbers, ahead for Alexander. Shot, he scores! Top right corner, 5-3 Ferris State. As I mentioned, what a step up by Connor Schmidt in the neutral zone to cause that Alexander breakaway. Unselfishness by Corey Kane. Five on that two, up the right wing. Kane with it now. Around Atkinson, Kane cuts in, shoots, he scores! Top right corner, 6-3, Ferris State. You mentioned an on mad rush, and that was five on two for the Bulldogs. Corey Kane with a beautiful individual effort to go wide on his back and kind of shield the D with his knee. Cut to the net, go high, glove side over Thompson for the Bulldogs, six goal, 6-3 six as he beats the defenseman wide of Josh Atkinson. He goes roof daddy above the glove of Thomas, 6-3, dogs lead. 